Baptist Health Sunday Family Fun Day in the baseball grounds of Jacksonville, the Jumbo Shrimp and the Blue Wahoos play Game 4 of the series. Welcome to Shrimp Show. Here's a swing and here's a drive deep to left field. Backing up on a Curseal, he'll have that go over the wall! John Norwood with a walk-off homer! Gordon flares it towards shallow left. Perez dives and makes the catch! Here's a swing, here's a drive deep down the right field line that falls for a base hit, bounces up against the warning track, and Jacksonville wins! Bo Shrimp starting a raucous celebration here at the baseball grounds. Hello again, everybody. I'm Roger Hoover, joined by Mark Olanave once again, and we're glad to welcome you to Shrimp Show on this Sunday afternoon. Last night, Marco, an exciting ball game, another tight contest between these two, and Jacksonville came out on top, two to one. It was a pitcher's duel, Cody Poteet starring for the Jumbo Shrimp going seven innings, and it was Brian Shales and John Norwood providing the offense in a Jumbo Shrimp win. Let's take a look back at the highlights from last night. Here's the 1-1. Swing, and he hits a high fly ball. Into right center, hustling over is Monte Harrison. He's to the warning track, up against the wall. Monte Harrison with a great catch. And there's one gone here in the second. The 0-2. Breaking ball is swung on and lifted high and deep down the left field line. This is back and this is gone. Aristides Aquino just down the left field line. His first homer of the season and that gives the Blue Wahoos a 1-0 lead in the second inning. First pitch from Gutierrez to start the third, a drive deep to right center. Going back, Aquino still going back. He looks up. This is gone. Ryan Shales, an opposite field homer, his second of the year, and we're tied at one in the bottom of the third. Two balls, two strikes on Norwood, who wears number 22, the pitch. Fly ball deep down the right field line, chasing it to the corner, Aquino. He won't catch it. This is gone. John Norwood with his third homer of the season. And in the bottom of the seventh inning, the Jumbo Shrimp have their first lead at 2-1. to one. Quijadas, 1-1. One, one. Swing and a bounding ball to third. Fielding at Shales, he's got it. Throws to first on a line, in time to Jagailo, and this ball game is over. The Jumbo Shrimp won a tight one tonight in Jacksonville. A final score of the Jumbo Shrimp, two, and the Blue Wahoos, one. For a third straight night, the Jumbo Shrimp and Blue Wahoos played a one-run contest. Jacksonville winning 2-1. Cody Poteet went a season-long seven innings. Jose Quijada picked up the save for Jacksonville. And John Norwood hit his third homer of the year, first at the baseball grounds, to lift Jacksonville to the win. Elsewhere in the Southern League on Saturday night, Mississippi defeated Jackson 4-3. The M Braves securing their second straight win over the North Division leaders. Mobile defeated Montgomery 1-0. It was a combined no-hitter for the Bay Bears. Chattanooga defeated Tennessee 6-4. Birmingham knocked off Biloxi 4-2. The Shuckers' lead in the South is down to, a to two and a half games. And now here's a closer look at the Southern League with the BC Championship Series standings. Now on Sunday afternoon, the Jumbo Shrimp look to secure a series win against Pensacola. And as we take a look at our starting pitching matchup for today, it's interesting to note the Jumbo Shrimp once again have a major leaguer joining the Jumbo Shrimp on a rehab assignment. Right-handed pitcher Eliezer Hernandez will be making his first start with Jacksonville after he had a pair of starts with the high-A Jupiter Hammerheads in his rehab appearance coming back from dental surgery that he had in spring training. He'll be opposed today by right-hander Jesus Reyes of the Blue Wahoos. He's still looking for his first win in 2018. Well, Baptist Health Sunday Family Fun Day at the baseball grounds of Jacksonville. Marco, the kids have already played catch in the field, and now they have a lot of activities for them in the Wolfson Children's Hospital Kids Zone. That's right. There's free face painting and balloon animals out there, Chris, kids' craft activities. Watch out for Jake the Pirate. He's our special character at the ballpark today. That's right, Roger. And following the game, you can run the bases. Kids 12 and under are invited onto the playing field here at the baseball grounds of Jacksonville. And also today, we're celebrating youth sports teams, so we welcome all of the youth sports athletes here to the ballpark. That's 
It's also National Shrimp Scampi Day, so make sure you head up to the Wheelhouse Lounge and pick up some shrimp scampi, shrimp shrimp scampi, however you say it. There are a lot of SSH sounds there. But anyway, it should be a great afternoon here at the baseball grounds of Jacksonville. Many reasons for you to share your experience with us on social media. Share. It also starts with SSH. That's right. Uh, find our mascot Scampi and take yeah. a picture. Share that on Facebook. You can like the Jacksonville Jumbo Shrimp. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at Jack Shrimp. We'd love to hear and see from you. Game four of the series between the Jumbo Shrimp and the Wahoos. Remember, tomorrow we have a business person special on Vistar Credit Union. Charity begins at home Monday, 12.05 start time tomorrow for the finale of this series between Jacksonville and Pensacola. If you're at the ballpark, just sit back and relax. We have baseball coming up. And also, if you're watching this online on our Jumbo Shrimp YouTube channel, just head on over to jackshrimp.com. There you can listen to the game through the Jumbo Shrimp Network. You can also watch on MILB.tv. For Marco Lanave, I'm Roger Hoover. Thanks for watching Shrimp Show.